All right, guys, this is a Lexus IS300. Yeah. Nothing really much to say about this one, but look how shiny that is. I'm here at a Costco uh, wholesale store, and they have this going on. Blah, blah, blah. Basically like a win this car or something like that. It's kind of glary, but you can see that there is red seats. Leather seats. You know, I think it's like the same color color that you find on the Ferraris. If not, at least in the Lexus LFA. If I darken it a little bit, you can see the wheel, a little bit of the dashboard. In fact, the new Lexus sports cars do, or even the new Lexus these days, they have the same infotainment screen layouts which you find in the Lexus LFA. I can't open the hood obviously, but I do know there's a V8 underneath here. Plus with Lexus, especially with their F Sport models, you usually have the V8s. Except the LFA, which has the V10. The other side. Here's the um, sticker price. Or, yeah. 38 thousand two hundred and ten dollars retail price and over here all you see here is all the options on this car and all the features and stuff so total 45 grand 26 miles per gallon combined city and highway all in all though it's a pretty damn sexy car I mean, it's a Lexus. Well, what do you expect? I mean, Lexus is too off, is an off, like a common car, but like, personally, if I was going to buy a Lexus, I'd rather buy an LFA. And stuff. But damn, look at these rims, too. Shiny. So, yeah, guys, that's it for your. That's it. This is the Lexus IS300. Also, if you look at these lug nuts, you can actually see that there's a uh, a rounded lug nut, whereas the other four are hexagonal. What that does is is to prevent theft, so nobody can have steal this rim or pretty much all the rims on this car. So they can take off all, take, they can take off these four, but they cannot take off that one. They need a special tool to do that. And there's like a 99.99% .99 chance that they're gonna steal a rim like this. So if you got one of those things, pretty much safe. But to be really on the safe side, put all five of these things on the rim. <laughs> you guys are also wondering, and some of these cars these days, you might wonder what these little circles are. None, the back doesn't just have this. They also have it on the front too. Those are actually um, parking sensors. So, or also one of those blind spot monitoring things. But basically what it does is when, when another car or another object gets close to this car, or any car, it would it would tell the driver that, hey, you're getting, you're getting too close. I think you should just move away and stuff like that. So that's what the basic idea is if you guys are, don't know what, what these things are. I also forgot to mention, for those of you who think that Lexus is just some American brand, but it's actually a, t a, uh, a sub, uh, sub brand for Toyota, as you can see, every, most of the assembly is done here in, done in Japan. Blah, blah, blah. And also, Toyota. Just look at that front. Why can't the LFA have something like this though? But oh well. 
And that's the Lexus IS300 once again.